Hi everyone and welcome to Tech Word Buying, the September 28th edition. Overall, it's a good time to shop for a laptop suited for creative tasks like photography, graphic design and music or just staying connected with savings nearing $400 in some cases. On the other hand, if what you need is a desktop computer for multitasking, creative experimentation or graphic design, it could be a good idea to wait for new rebates to surface. The right accessories can help make the time you spend at your desk more comfortable and enjoyable, especially when using your computer for prolonged sessions. I haven't mentioned the DTX60 in a while, but at its current price it's an option worth exploring. Otherwise, the OnePlus 6 and iPhone 8 are stronger, more recent favorites of mine. These tablets, including a Chromebook convertible, take very different approaches to mobile computing, excelling respectively at low-cost versatility, portable gaming and adaptability. Right now, $500 lets you buy a laptop for everyday tasks with a screen which won't leave you much space to display multiple documents at once or enjoy most movies in full details. Full HD notebooks starts appearing around $800 and at higher price tags start specializing in multimedia capability or work autonomy. And finally, stationary computers tend to deliver the most brawn for the investment, as long, of course, as your activities concentrate at your desk. Alternatively, an all-in-one system like this HP Pavilion could be worth investigating if you need more workspace than a laptop can provide but still need to take some space-saving measures. Those were my recommendations for this week. No one has had a hand in making this video and you can learn more about me and what I'm doing over on techadvisor.ca slash about. Prices and stock levels fluctuate all the time, so I recommend consulting the detailed and up-to-date version of this list on techadvisor.ca slash newsletter. Thank you very much for watching and enjoy your weekend.